here again with another video. And today I got the Alienware 13 inch R3 with OLED display. Now I ordered this back in November straight from Alienware and it finally arrived after a month. So my last Alienware was the first gen 17 inch back in uh, 2009, 2010 around that time. But uh, when I saw that they came out with a 13 inch OLED, I wanted to get this one. Now I'll probably use this to play games like Overwatch and League, which I actually haven't played yet in a long time. Um, and when I ordered this one off Alienware, I ordered with a i7 processor. Also comes with an i5, but I just wanted i7. Um, I also got 16 gigs of RAM, and it also comes with the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1060 with six gigabytes of video RAM. So this thing's a beast, guys. Anyways, enough of the tech specs and stuff. I'll put it down in the description if you guys want to know more about all the tech specs about this 13-inch uh, laptop. But um, yeah, let's get to the unboxing. So this is the box that FedEx dropped off a few days ago. So nothing fancy. You got your Alienware logo right here. And, um, you know, it looks kind of beat up actually, but... Um, Let's open it up, guys, and see what's inside. So, I got my trusty unboxing knife. Cut this open. See if that worked. All right. So basically, the packaging outside is just wrapping. And let's get to it. Let's see what, what's in here. All right, close the knife first. All right, all we gotta do is push it out, it looks like. Boom. So here it is. Nice black box, Alienware. Got the nice Alien logo. And you know, this Alienware is actually brought up by Dell now, I think a few years ago, but when I got my Alienware 17 inch years ago, it was its own separate company. So here's the box I wanna show you guys. Carrying case in the back is just some cool graphics. Nothing too fancy. And uh, yeah, let's open her up. So looks like I just gotta open this. And there it is, guys. That's the laptop, right in the box. Pretty nice packaging from Alienware slash Dell. And uh, let's take it out. So, wow. Actually, this feels really solid. I mean, it's metal, or at least parts of it are metal. And I forgot how much it actually weighs, but, um, it actually weighs more than my MacBook Pro 15 inch that I use daily. So I'm guessing this weighs about four or five pounds, maybe a little bit more, but uh, it's pretty thin. You know, like here's my Apple watch to compare, pretty thin and uh, feels really solid guys. I'm not kidding you. I'm not a big Windows laptop fan, but um, this guy's pretty solid. All right. Let's Put the guy on the side for now. Let's see what's all, what else is in the box. So you got some uh, some history from Alienware. So you know it talks about Alienware and how they formed. I guess some of their social networking sites. So if you guys want to check it out, here it is. But no, don't really care for this. All right, what else is in here? Nice little envelope, all black. And in the envelope, there's a um, quick start guide. Uh, nothing too important. Probably never gonna see this again. Put down the side. And I'm guessing where's the power supply? It must be in here somewhere. Well, oh, it's right here in the back. So there's a back compartment in the box and it has the brick let's take it out 
So here's the power brick. It's actually pretty big. So, you know, I guess to power this thing, you need a pretty good power source. So I'm not kidding you. It's not really that portable, I guess. The power brick itself is pretty big and pretty thick. So here it is compared to the laptop. You know, it's about maybe 25% thicker than the laptop. But, um, it is what it is and you also get the extension cord so again regular extension cord for a power brick usually for Dells I remember I had this on my Alienware 17 inch also I believe and also on my Dell XPS 13 inch which was like years ago guys so there it is I don't think there's anything else in the box um, yeah I think that's it so let me close this up for now put this back don't need this anymore and um, let me show you guys the laptop actually so put this back here got the Alienware logo rocking the Alienware logo all right guys so Let's check out the laptop. We got the power brick, we got the extension cord, and let's open up the laptop for the first time. What's interesting is I noticed that the hinging is not all in the back, it's actually somewhere before the end of it. And I want to show you guys the different ports. Let's see, it looks like a US, USB C port right here. A regular USB port and in the back let's see what we got in the back I don't know what this thing is I guess it's just a screw but uh, you got the your, your gigabit connector and I think this one has the killer car, uh, killer networking networking card and this looks like Thunderbolt you got HDMI you got another USB-C I want to say I could be wrong I don't know what this is actually check it out later and you got the Alienware port and this allows you to connect it to an external GPU and this is just for power on the outer side of the laptop you got another USB port and microphone microphone and uh, headphone jacks nothing else in the front so let's see what how it looks like when we open her up pretty nice so here's the keyboard nice screen uh, I don't know I'm gonna set this up check out the screen but I uh, just want to show you guys the keyboard close up right here keys feel pretty nice I'm gonna try it out trackpad and um, from at least what I've seen on the Alienware website, you can uh, customize the lighting of this. So we're going to do that in a few minutes. Um, but um, that's it for now, I think. Let me see. Let me take off this plastic. And it's a really glossy screen, guys. I'm not a big fan of super glossy screens, but um, it is what it is again. And you got the, again, I ordered it with the i7, Core i7 processor. And it also comes in a Core i5, but why would you do that to yourself? Anyways, uh, let's see if this powers on. And it does. It looks like it pow powers on without, um, without me having to charge it. So it comes powered on. It's really too much glare for you guys to see, I guess. But, um... Got the Alienware logo right here, loading screen. And yeah, that's the OLED display right here. Nothing too fancy. So I'll be back. I'm gonna set, set it up and I'll show you guys, I guess the different features of this uh, laptop, at least setting up the Alienware like display because um, 
as long as I remember on my 17 inch, I, I changed the keyboard color, the trackpad color, so it's pretty cool. And uh, I'll be back. Hey guys, so it took about five, 10 minutes to set up everything. And um, I got the computer set up right now and I played around with it and I gotta say, this video doesn't do it justice, but the display is beautiful. This OLED is super beautiful colors. It has a resolution, I think, of like 2560 by 1440. So not 4K, but, um, you know, pretty high resolution, especially for a 13-inch laptop. But the screen is gorgeous, guys. I mean, the white bonds is all screwed up on this video because of the different lighting. But it's great. And um, what's included is the Alienware Command Center. And this is what I love about Alienware. You can customize the lighting. So... I'm into orange right now for some reason, so I made everything orange. Orange touchpad, orange keys, orange Alienware. Logos also on the front, and there's like literally, I think like 20 something colors you can change it to, and different combinations. There's different, there's four different uh, layouts on the keyboard. It's separated into four different regions for your gaming needs. But um, yeah, this is uh, really nice, guys. The screen is beautiful. And another thing I want to talk about is the sound quality. And I'm not sure what the speakers are. I think they're on the sides, but um, in terms of uh, speakers, it's pretty good. I mean, I can't say it's great. I think my MacBook Pro is about the same quality as this one. So, you know, you know, if you're playing games, you're probably going to want to connect this to a headphones or external speakers, but not bad by itself. And... Uh, I want to show you guys like a 4K video. Let's see if I can bring up one of my old videos on YouTube. Let's see. And I'm going to rewind it a little bit. But um, let's, let's try to uh, maximize it. So hard to see on this video, but it's really beautiful screen. It's really nice. Uh, definitely recommend you guys get the OLED. The 13 inch OLED, it's amazing. The blacks are really black. Color saturation is beautiful on it. But um, yeah, I'm gonna play around with this laptop more. Maybe play some games, install some games. I got Overwatch, I got League. And uh, I'll let you guys know what I think in the comments or in a future video. But uh, you know, here it is. This is the Dell R13 with OLED display. Uh, thanks for watching guys and until the next video take care and uh, peace guys